Hello, my name's Bob. I'd like to thank my Savior, Lord Jesus Christ, the Holy Spirit for guiding me every single day and I talk to on a daily basis as a person. I hear him even when he whispers. That's how deeply I really hear him. And I'd like to thank everybody who's watching this video. He told me a couple of days ago to finally get out of my comfort zone and do a video message. Yes, this is my very first one and I'm a little nervous, but I'm, I'm gonna wing it. And I'd like to talk to you about something simple, about a couple of things, about how much he really loves all of us, and I'll say all of us, and how much he wakes us up and grants us another day. We all automatically assume we go to bed, we making plans for tomorrow, we making plans for the next, for the weekend, for next week, next month, we making plans for our goals in our lives, but who can go to bed at night and guarantee that they're gonna wake up in the morning? If you really deeply think about it, you go to bed at night, are you guaranteed you're gonna wake up? I can't. I can't guarantee that. And God loves all of us so much. Of course, he died, he died on the cross for us. We all know that. And if you believe in him and those who don't believe in him, those who turn their back on him, like Jesus told Simon Peter, you're going to deny me three times. Simon Peter said, oh, no, I won't. And what happened? At the end of the at the end of it all, he denied him three times. Did God turn his back? No. He still loved him. Just like he loves all of us. He loves, his love is unconditional. He loves those who believe in him, don't believe in him. Those who turn their back, he still wakes them up another day. He loves everybody. He loves us all. And it's always good in the morning to start the day with talking to Jesus, thanking him for that day, granting you another day to spend time with those you love, those you care about, those that mean so much to you, and another day to be the best you can be, because when you're being the best you can be, you don't know whose life you're going to touch for the positive. Something simple like saying hello, a kind word to somebody who's having a bad day, oh, you look good, you know, spreading God's favor, God's word. You don't know how much that's going to brighten somebody's day. Plus, with the enemy always on a prowl, always looking to make us negative, get spread his negativity in our mind, brainwash us with his negativity, and make us depressed, you know, make us get angry and hate somebody and so forth and so on. You know what I'm talking about. It's always good to start the day with something positive by waking up, realizing I got another day. Thank you, Lord, for granting me another day. That's always a good mindset to start the day with. And in closing, I'd like to say once again, thank you for watching this. You can leave comments if you like. I'm going to go on. Leave comments. I'd love for you to leave comments. Like I said, this is my first video. But one of my mottos I like to tell everybody always be the best you can be it's the easiest thing you can do but some people it's the hardest but it's it's so easy when all you do is be always put your best foot forward be the best you can be that's all God asks of us be the best you can be because you don't know whose life you're going to touch for the positive by being the best you can be and thank God above I'm going to share this. this is my first message I hope it helps you. Have a nice day. God bless.